Good morning, Minuteman. Minute Man. Today is Friday, December 10th, 2021. All students should be wearing a mask and let's take a moment to ensure that they're adjusted properly. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for the announcements. Candy cane grams will be on sale during all four lunches and each candy cane is $1 and will be delivered on December 23rd during advisory. We are only accepting in-person cash offers. Students will choose a gram and fill it out at their time of purchase. There will be no online orders or electronic payments. Please help bring cheer to some elderly at the Winchester Nursing Home. Just a reminder that the home made non-denominational holiday cards and are being accepted through December 22nd. The card box is located on the Benjamin Mann Lobby. Thank you for your contributions. Backstage crew from Drama Club will meet on Tuesday next week instead of the regularly scheduled Monday. The schedule for actors has not changed. The National Honor Society is sponsoring the Toys for Tots program again this year, and we'd love your support. Toys for Tots is a program that supports families in need during the holiday season. Please consider donating new unwrapped toys for children of all ages. The donation box can be found in the main entrance. Thank you. Seniors, please check for an email from Mr. Junkus that contains the Minmin Scholarship application to be completed before winter break. If you have any questions, email or stop by his room across the guidance department. The GSA will meet Tuesday in the art room from 2.30 to 3.30 to create holiday cards and decorations. All students are welcome to join us. Late last week, the math team traveled to Arlington Catholic and extended their streak of success, missing second place by only two points while beating the other five schools. Freshman Sunay Arqual and Zeriel Yu led Minuteman scores on the individual rounds. Veteran leadership from Charlie Brewell and Horace Zari fueled the effort in the team rounds, where Minuteman's score was equal to the score of all seven other teams combined. Anyone interested in joining the squad should contact Horace and Zari or Mr. Skogstrom for more information. The Commonwealth Conference, co Conference Cross Country All-Stars have been formally announced and the two Minuteman names are on the list. Congratulations to Jack Tucker and Alex Nikolai for their impressive performances on the league meet several weeks ago. Jack Grader also ran a great race, narrowly missing the honors. And now for High Five Friday. High five to all of the Minuteman player actors who showed up this week for the theater workshops as they started the process of writing sections of their own version of the play, Brainstorm. High five to all of the members of the Minuteman players backstage crew that showed up this past Monday afternoon to set up and break down the staging for the upcoming drama club production of the play, Brainstorm. High five to the robotics and automation sophomore class who worked diligently all day even when their shop teacher was out. Nice work. High five to Henry Blackburn, Sydney Judd, and Nadia Strange for assisting Miss Norrison with tours for some special guests from the town of Lexington. High five to the CVC sophomores for their awesome work ethic, attitude, and creativity this week during the kickoff of our typography unit. Great work, everyone. High five to all of the National Honor Society members conducting interviews. Mr. English is forever grateful. High five for Mr. Backman's advisory for standing up and reciting the pledge. It was an awesome to see the whole class participating. High five to the junior pits masters, Lucas Goodwin, Sam Zachary, Tommy Gallagher, Aiden Goff, Derek O'Brien, Dean O'Brien, and John O'Brien of the Minuteman Barbecue Club, who took time out of their Saturday last week to prepare 275 meals for the homeless. Great job, guys. High five to the juniors in Metal Fab for doing a great job of working with the exploratory freshmen and supporting their shop week last week. Nice job. High five to all second and third year teachers for making it through all the craziness for the past couple of years. High five to Gavin O'Brien, John O'Brien, and Shane Carta for being named league all-stars this past soccer season. Congrats, guys. And high five to Miss Gleason for a great job she's doing with our senior students on working with their senior projects. High five to the DVC seniors for absolutely crushing it this week on the beginning of their senior projects. High five to the environmental sophomores for consistently working hard, staying positive, and keeping us all laughing. The tanks and the greenhouse look great in large part because of you. Great job, everyone, this week. Next week, freshmen and juniors will be in shop with freshmen completing their exploratory rotation number four. From all of us here at Minuteman, have a nice Friday and a great weekend.